Hello beauties, welcome back. So we are trudging on through, we made it past all of the January subscription boxes that I neglected. We're now like almost, almost to the finish line for our, uh, our filming of the February subscription boxes. So today we have our boxy charm. You guys have always, you guys are always great about communicating with me. I've seen a lot of mixed things. A lot of people have been like really disappointed with boxy. Like the last year they were like, I have not been in love with it. I do not feel that way. I have been really satisfied. I feel like they've been stronger than Ipsy, minus like one or two boxes uh, last year that were just kind of like, eh. but I'm very happy with it. I was really happy with January's. I know nothing about February's and I honestly can't remember if I chose a product to customize. I don't think I did. Um, so I'm excited to see what we're gonna get today. Let's jump in and see. Okay. First thing I see, super excited about, this is a Tula Skincare So Poreless Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. I love all things Tula. One of my favorite makeup, I mean, skincare brands right now. I just, I love their eye cream. I love their moisturizer. I love their primers. I love everything about it. Um, so yes, really nice. Obviously it's full size, but it's really nice size. And uh, yes, exci super excited about that. Honestly, you can send me pretty much anything from Tula and I'd be like, I'm so ready for it, yes. The next thing we have is actually something that I know I've gotten, I've gotten in both Ipsy and BoxyCharm, but this is a different variation of it. So this is the Trasique, uh, this is the Eye Duo Good Vibes Mascara and Eye Pencil. So I've gotten the mascara from both Ipsy and BoxyCharm before. The whole thing with this mascara is it actually comes with a, uh, eyelash curler on the end of it. My mom has also gotten this and she does not like it because she's like, this is too small, I can't curl my eyelashes. I actually like it because you can cut, curl it in sections, which is, I, I kind of prefer that. But it is actually one of my go-to mascaras. I really do enjoy it. Um, it does have like that nice kind of like that, I, I don't know what else to call it other than like the better than sex like style where it's like the, that's what I think about it. I don't think that they were the first one that used that design, but I just, that's what I associate with it, sorry. But it's got that kind of like uh, curvy, I don't know what to call it, voluptuous, I don't know, like design to it where it's like big at the top and kind of comes in and then goes back down to being white again. So I really like it. It doesn't really clump that much, good formula. So excited about that. But this one comes with an eye pencil as well. So that's the first time that I've seen this where they give you an eyeliner to go with it too kind of a nice like little and this is actually like a retractable one so this is more of like the eye crayon is i guess what you would call it i'm a big fan of tristique i like their lip shades as well so i'm definitely excited to try it don't love the fact that we're seeing another mascara i mean not mascara another eyeliner when we just got one but it I'm not gonna complain about it. I'm liking everything else so far, so. Next thing we have is from Evo Beauty, which is the Pore Perfect Primer. Yeah, it's a matte finish primer. I love getting primers, so a good products. I've never tried the brand, so I don't, I don't know it, but I like pore based primers where they're gonna go in and kind of like smooth over your pores, so. Seems like it'll be good. Oh, that's, oh, these are, oh, y'all. It's a brush set from Glamier, I think. I, I don't know what to say other than like all, all I, the only thing I can think when I see this is like being at like Chuck E. Cheese or like some sort of place like that where they have the prize counter and you bring up your tickets and this would be something that would be like on the back shelf and you would need like a thousand tickets for it and you'd be like, I have 200. And they'd be like, well, you can get a ring. That's what this, this is the whole, this whole aesthetic is giving, that's what I'm getting from that. Like I'm thinking of like my birthday parties in the fourth grade. That is not a bad thing, by the way. Uh, that's a, that's, it's just, that's exactly what I thought when I first saw it. Oh, I love them. I love them, they're so cute. It's a brush set and it's got like little, look at it. Okay, so this is like, like that's had that had to be what they were going for, right? Like I'm not crazy, right? Like this is totally like feeding into all like our like our uh, millennial like youth. We're like we had these, right? You guys, I'm not going crazy, right? Like everybody else is everybody else having this fever dream too, or is it just me? Because I'm I love it. I'm I don't want it to ever end. That may be my favorite product, if I'm being honest, from this from this box. A lot of good products, but this may be my this may be my top tier product right here. All right, final thing we have here is from Ace Beauté. This is the Nostalgia palette. I love getting palettes. I love Ace Beauté. We've gotten several palettes from BoxyCharm from them, and I'm excited to see what this one looks like. Not expecting that. 
just gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Just love it. Love, love everything about it. So much you can do with it. Vibrant colors just gives, I just, it really, nostalgia is the name of it, but like their design with the flowers is exactly what I'm getting. I feel like I'm just walking through a rainforest of colors. Love it. I'm so excited. I love it. I love it. I, I will say the nice thing about BoxyCharm is really they've done a good job of like with their boxes kind of giving you more adventurous stuff. Whereas I feel like Ipsy kind of sometimes plays it safer. I really love this box though. Definitely, I don't think this palette would be for everybody because I know like my mom would get it and be like, I don't know what to do with it. But this for me is like, oh, it's exactly what I'm looking for. Something new, exciting colors. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Great box, just love. I love BoxyCharm, I really do. Um, I've had only like one or two times where I've really felt disappointed with them. I, yeah, I just do, I enjoy it so much. So yes, let's look at the price breakdown. All right, so price breakdown. First thing we got, the Ace Beauté palette is $38.99. The Tula Skin Care Blackhead uh, Deep Exfoliating Scrub is $32. The Trustique uh, Duo is $44. Evio Beauty Pore Perfect Primer is $23. And the, uh, the Precious Little it's nostalgia inducing toy from the place that I said at the beginning. You weren't in the room, so you don't remember. Chuck E. Cheese, Chuck E. Cheese. Yes, this that is bringing back fever dreams of my childhood that I am here for is $29.95, which gives us a value of $167.94. Honestly, a lower priced box, just comparatively, um, but well worth it. I mean, like, it's just great products. Like, I'm very happy with it. Yes, love it, love it. I really am, I cannot get over this. These, these are so cute. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys got, what you guys thought of this month. If you're happy with BoxyCharm, if you're not happy with BoxyCharm, I love hearing all of it. So yeah, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you like us, subscribe, because we would love for you to be part of the Dark Angel family. And other than that, I hope you guys are all safe, healthy, you have a wonderful day, and you stay girly with the Dark Twist.